guys welcome back to the Moran family so today's video is going to be a huge organize and declutter with me I need to go through my closet my kids closet I need to go through baby's things because if you're new here I am 20 weeks pregnant with my fourth daughter my rainbow baby and then I have a six-year-old and a two-year-old and an angel baby so I just need to go through all of our stuff and just get rid of clothes that don't fit us. I really need to declutter things because the nursery is actually going to be in our master bedroom. So I need to go through my dresser and make room for baby girl. I need to go through my closet and just make a bunch of room for her. So with all of that being said, let's go ahead and jump into it because I have a lot of stuff that I want to get done today. So this is what my room looks like right now. As you can see, there's just kind of stuff all over the place so this is my side of the bed and then this is Benny's I'm not sure if I'm going to clear out all of this stuff today I know I've been saying I need to do it for the longest but every time I have like the energy and the motivation to clean Benny's not here so he's actually at work and like 90% of this stuff is his I don't know where he wants to put it and like what needs to get thrown out, what he's keeping, all of that stuff. So I'm probably not going to get to this huge pile today, but it needs to be cleared out because baby girl's crib is going to be right here. And then this is our dresser. All of those three are Benny's and then these three on this side is mine. This is baby girl's hamper, but I just have like blanket stuffed in it so that way I can reshape it because it came folded so like I said these three drawers are mine and I just really need to go through them like this is my PJ drawer I don't wear like 90% of that and then this is like my like bra and underwear drawer and then this top drawer I kind of already cleared out of my stuff I do have a few things in here that are mine but for the most part everything that I have for baby girl right now is in here so I have like, I have pacifiers, bottles, passy clips. I even have like my pregnancy test in here. Um, I have some outfits for her, a changing pad. I have two more outfits right here. Bobby pillow covers, a little rainbow that I like to take pictures with. So I have some things for baby girl, but this is pretty much it. I haven't really bought her anything. If you guys follow me on Instagram, then you know my thoughts on it, why I haven't really bought baby girl anything. But this is my pregnancy after a loss because we did lose our last daughter, Everly. She passed away an hour after birth due to holoprosen cephaly and trisomy 13. So I've just been really emotional this pregnancy and I've had a lot of like fears and just anxiety and stuff. I've just been really hesitant on buying baby girl things, but a couple days ago, I finally got the courage to buy baby things, and I cried, and I was just so excited, and I even cried when I got like two outfits in the mail the other day, and it's just, it's so scary and exciting. As far as we know, baby girl is completely healthy. All of her testing has come back normal, but I'm still waiting on my anatomy scan and I feel like that's the last thing that's making me nervous and hesitant on buying baby things. I have that coming up in a couple weeks so I'm hoping I feel a lot more like relaxed and comfortable once I have that. But anyways, I feel like I'm rambling to you guys so let's get back to the like organizing and decluttering. So all of this stuff on top of my dresser as well is baby girl's things. So here's her bathtub. I'm not really sure where to put that yet. So that's just there. And then I have like her boppy pillow and a lounger and then I have a diaper bag right here. So that stuff is probably going to just stay right here where it is. And then I did buy this for baby girl's drawer. So this is like a storage organizer. I got this off of Amazon. I only bought one pack for now. It comes in a set of six. I only got one, that way I can like test it out and see how it fits in the drawer, see how I like it. So let's go ahead and put this open. Okay, so here is what all of them looks like. So it came with two giant ones. And then it came with these like rectangle ones and then two small ones. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and take out all of this stuff, lay it out on my bed, and then I'm going to put those in the drawer and then I'll see like how I want things. 
Life was dull until you came I was breathless when we first met Couldn't keep my hands away I was speechless when we first met, yeah Here's the setup that I did. I'm not sure how I want it. I kept changing them and then I also have like room to get one more so I'm probably going to buy more packs. But baby girl's changing station is going on top of my dresser so I'm gonna have like diapers and wipes in here as well. So I'm not too sure how I want it yet but that's how I have it. And then I put everything on my bed. You want to say hi baby? Mm-hmm. Say hi. hi. This pile is kind of like my stuff that was in here. And then this right here is all of baby girl's things. Hi. Life was dull until you came. Now I see in color again. It could rain, I don't mind if it pours. Cause I'm right next to you. To you. Come rain or come shine, I don't mind. Cause I'm right next to you. So here is what the drawer looks like so far. I'm obviously going to reorganize this as I get more baby things. Like this stuff is not going to be in this drawer, so I need to put this away somewhere else. And then I didn't want to open like any of the packages just because I didn't want them to like get all dusty and dirty and all of that because I am 20 weeks, so I still have a while to go. So I just have all of that shoved in here, like pacifiers, pacifier clips. The bottle obviously is not going to stay in here and then her clothes are going to get like reorganized but like I said I'm just going to just have everything in here for now I just wanted to start setting it up so that way I can like know how I want things I'm probably going to see if I can clear out another drawer for her so I'm gonna try clearing out my stuff get rid of a lot of things that I don't wear and then I'm gonna see if I'm able to fit all of my stuff in one drawer and then I'll give baby girl another drawer. actually able to fit everything in one drawer I think I'm going to get some of those organizer bins for my drawer that way it doesn't look as cluttered but this is pretty much like my leggings pile my PJ bottoms my tops and these are just some like Halloween jammies and then Christmas ones so those are my holiday PJs and then I have all my socks right here my underwear and then the bras that I wear so this drawer right here is actually 100% cleared out. So I'm going to buy some more bins and then I'm probably going to give this drawer to baby girl too. That way, since I told you guys I'm going to be using this dresser as her changing table, that way I can just use this drawer as like diapers, wipes, nail clippers, all of that stuff. And then I can just use this drawer for clothes that I'm not going to be hanging in the closet. And then this pile right here is donation. That's stuff I'm not going to be keeping. So that's all of the stuff that I got cleared out from my drawer. And then now I'm going to take you guys in my closets. I've never showed you guys my closet because it's pretty crazy. Here's my closet. It's kind of crazy and I have so much stuff that needs to go from here. So this entire side is Benny's. I need him to organize it better too because it just drives me insane. But I'm not going to touch his stuff because I don't want to get rid of things that I don't know if he wants to get rid of them. So I'm not going to touch his side. This shelf right here, Benny has some stuff on it. And then this is mine. I need to go through that bag because I think there's maternity clothes in there. And then I need to go through all of my jeans because I don't wear like 90% of these. I have some maternity ones in here that I've been wearing, so I just need to go through those. 
because most of those I don't even wear when I'm not pregnant. Also need to go through my shoes because I have some shoes that I don't wear. I think down under here I also have some, yeah, I have sandals down there. And then I have like diaper bags all right here. So I need to just go through all of this because this is all of my clothes. If you guys watch my videos, you know I'm like in graphic tees all the time. So I 100% don't wear like 90% of this. Most of this rack down here is like sweatshirts, sweaters, jackets. So I need to go through all of these because I don't wear like most of them. All of these right here are my shirts. So I need to go through all of these because I have a lot of like tiny crop tops that I no longer wear. And then right here I have all of my dresses. I don't wear like most of these pretty much. I have some bags hanging right here. And then I have like more bags down there. I have beanies up here and hats. So I need to go through all of this. I think I'm going to clear this out. Put my jackets here. And then I'm going to give baby girl this entire rack right here. And then I'm going to try to clear most of this stuff out. And then I want to buy like baskets. So that way this stuff is like more organized and it's not like just thrown everywhere. So yeah, that's the plan. I'm going to just go through all of my clothes. This closet is pretty tight though. So I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to film it for you guys. Because yeah, as you can see, like when the door is open, it's... It's a pretty tight squeeze in there. Has never felt this close and when you kiss me, I can't believe that I am yours and you are mine. You took the pain away. So here's all of the jeans that I'm going to donate. They just don't fit anymore and I never wear them. So I'm getting rid of all of those. And then this is what I'm working with now. So in this bin, I have shorts like my pre-pregnancy shorts. So I'm keeping these because I used to wear these all the time. So hopefully those fit. These are also my pre-pregnancy jeans that I would wear like all the time. So hopefully these still fit. So I'm keeping those for now. And then this little pile right here is actually maternity jeans. my PJ drawer that I showed you these are some sandals that I'm getting rid of these are way too tight but they're so cute they're from Target and then I don't really remember where these ones are but I need to get rid of them which is so sad because they're my favorite sandals ever but the sides are like the sides are all ripped this is maternity clothes from like when I was pregnant with Layla and it's just so not my style anymore like I would never wear this stuff so i'm getting rid of this i'm gonna donate it another mom can probably use it more than i can and then these are all the jeans that i showed you guys i have like jean jackets in here i have sweaters a whole bunch of tank tops that probably would never fit me in a million years anymore but yeah this is like all of the clothes i have like scarves that i'm getting rid of and then here is what my closet looks like like i said i'm not touching benny stuff so i put my shoes that i don't wear like every day down here these are like so beat up but i save them because whenever we visit benny's dad's house he lives like surrounded by just dirt so i wear these ones that way my other shoes don't get dirty these ones i wear for like walking or if we go to like a theme park i wear these and then these are my combat boots i absolutely love combat boots for like the fall and winter so these are like the two that I wear all the time once the weather starts cooling down. This is like my jeans that I showed you guys. And then this is my closet now. So here's a reference of how much stuff that I got rid of. So I got rid of quite a bit. And then down here, I just have like all of my diaper bags. I'm currently using this one. It's not a diaper bag, but I got it from Target a while ago. So I'm currently using that one. 
This is the one that I was using so much. It's by Hi Aria. I love that one. And then I have a Miss Fong. It's a Fawn Design dupe. And then I actually have the brown mini version inside of it. And then I used to use this as a diaper bag for Aurora too. It's just a regular like black book bag from Target. And then I have my Ryla pack diaper bag. So as you can see, I'm pretty set on diaper bags because I have another one over there on my dresser that I showed you guys earlier. Probably going to move them up there once I have Benny's help because I couldn't exactly reach up there. And then down here, I have like extra makeup, which you guys know I don't even wear a lot of makeup. So I need to go through that, but that's like another day. I don't even want to tackle that right now because I still have to go in the girls' room. So this is cleared out for baby girl. This whole side right here is cleared out for baby girl. It's pretty big, so all of her clothes should fit there. I kind of want to get like, because as you guys can see, like there's holes all down this. So I want to see if I can order like some more like shelving right here so that way like all of baby girls like extra things that i don't use all the time can go right here and i can just use this entire thing for storage and then i have like my crossbody purses right here i like to use these for whenever i am kid free so i have those i have swimsuits in here and then up here i have like my hats my Disney hats, and then scarves. I'm so excited. We got something big in the mail for a baby girl. Yeah. It's her stroller. So here is the stroller that we went for baby girl. It's the Chico Mini Bravo Plus, and I'm so excited for this. It's just in all black. The color is called Storm, but it's just completely black, and I'm just so excited. And since I'm right here, I might as well give you guys a little bump update. So that is my belly at almost 21 weeks now. So now it's time to work in the girls' room. So here's what I'm working with. I need to go through all of their clothes. This is all Aurora's right here. And then from like right here to down there is Layla's. Like 90% of this stuff does not fit them anymore either. And then I need to go through their drawers too because their drawers are so bad. Like everything is just thrown in here. There's so much stuff like that does not fit. The closet is just so not organized. And don't mind the way the closet looks right now, by the way, too. We have to take off the door on this side because the bottom track broke. So I need to order another one. That way Benny can put the door back on. This side, I need to go through this too. There's like all the jackets on this side. There's this little cart that is super messy. So I just need to go through their entire closet. I also bought some organizers for their closet as well the ones that i got to the girls are different than the ones that i used in my room so these are just like dividers it comes with five so here's what they look like i haven't even tried them out yet so hopefully they work so here's what it looks like so when you push or when you pop up this button or something it's supposed to extend and then it just goes inside the drawer like that so hopefully these work if I like them, I'm going to buy more because, like I said, I only bought one pack. So I'm going to just go through all of their clothes right now. through all of that this is how much clothes the girls now have but I actually did let me go grab that I did do a haul of all of this clothes if you guys want to watch that I will have it linked so the girls do have clothes like I'm not just like getting rid of everything and then they're gonna have like nothing to wear so this is all of their new clothes 
And then that's all of the stuff that they wear too. That's their dirty clothes. So they have all of that and all of this. So they're good. I'm going to have to go through this pile because I did come across some baby things. So I'm totally going to save these things for baby girl. But look how cute this little thing is. So I'm going to have to go through all of this because there is a lot of like baby things. Like that's how long ago I've gone through the girls' clothes. Like... This is like 18 months, I believe. Yeah. Aww. This was Aurora's baby blanket, guys. It's so cute. I'm definitely gonna have to save that. I have all of the girls' like Disney ears and Disney hats in here. Aww, I also have picture frames in here, guys. Look, this is from 2014. That's Rory Booty. And then this one is Aurora too. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. This was also Aurora. This was one of her swaddle blankets. So I'm totally gonna save that for baby too. This is everything that came out of their drawers. Like, how did I let it get so bad? Like, my goodness. I need to go through this, like I said, because look at these. These are brand new, and these are like 18 months. So I can totally save some of this for baby. But I cleared out all of the drawers. So now I just need to go through this stuff, organize it. I need to put those little organizer things in their drawers the way i had their drawers set up was the top one was kind of like random things like beanies bathing suits just stuff that they use but like not everyday things if that makes sense and then the drawer below that one the second drawer i had all of layla's stuff and then the third drawer was aurora stuff and then the fourth drawer was like all of their pants i don't know if i'm going to keep it the same or if i'm going to put like all of their leggings in like their drawer because like i said i had their leggings separate here's what i did i only bought five like i said so I think in the girls' drawer, I'm going to give them each two. And then I'll do like socks and underwears, PJs, and then bottoms. I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to give two to Aurora, two to Layla. And then I'm probably going to do the same thing what I originally had in this top drawer. I'm going to do like beanies and bathing suits, just stuff like that that they don't wear every single day. And then I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the bottom.
here is all of the girls' clothes now. All of the colors make me so happy. So I color coordinated their hangers. That way I know like which is like for Aurora, which is for Layla. So all of the white ones are Aurora's clothes. And then all of these pink ones are Layla's. So as you can see, I downsized a lot. But that's what I wanted. So I kind of went with like the same color schemes for tops and then like their bottoms that way i can just like mix and match a lot of outfits and i can get more wear out of the little clothes that they have versus like buying too many and then like they don't wear clothes because that was like the situation so this top drawer is like mini mouse ears like disney stuff beanies bathing suits and then like dress up stuff so then this one is layla's drawer her drawer is pretty full right now, so I'm probably going to have to change this. This is like her socks and underwear right here, her PJs, and then all of her like shorts and jeans and leggings. So I'm probably going to have to take out this whole section, like all of her bottoms, and then put them in the bottom drawer because that's completely empty. So I'm probably going to take out this and then leave this whole space open for PJs because I still have to catch up on laundry and Layla has some things in there still. And then this one is Aurora's. Like I said, I have to catch up on laundry so a lot of her PJs are in there. And then these are all of her underwears, her socks, and then these are all of her bottoms. And then the bottom drawer is 100% empty. So I'm probably going to put the girls' bottoms back in here. At least Layla's because Layla's drawer is pretty full like i said and then on this side of the closet it's like all of their sweaters that fits them and then i saved a little bit of long sleeve that still fits them just in case it's kind of cold because the weather can be kind of bipolar out here down here i have this storage cart this cart really came in handy when aurora was a baby because i put like all of my breastfeeding essentials on it I used it as like a diaper cart. So I might put this in my room and use it for baby girl because as you can see, it's pretty empty right now. So I just have like all of the girls' hair stuff and some wipes and stuff. And then this is actually a crib mattress that I bought for Aurora and I'm gonna just use it for baby girl too. Whew, I had to sit down for a second. I am so tired and so out of breath. I just wanna get this done. So the last thing that I have to do is just go through all of this clothes. I'm not gonna keep every single thing I know it probably would be best to save most of it that way i can just like hand down layla's things to aurora and then aurora's things to baby girl but i already know myself if i keep most of this and then i store it in a bin i'm gonna like forget about it and procrastinate about like going through it and then i'm gonna just like they're gonna just basically go to waste i know myself i'm gonna procrastinate on it so i'm gonna just go through this really quickly get this done and then i'll see you guys in a little bit finally done so here is what the girls' closet looks like everything is so organized it looks so much better and then these are all of the bags that came out of our room so there's a five bags for donation and then i put some more baby stuff in here so here's the top drawer for baby girl and then this drawer so i have some swaddles in here this one used to be aurora's this one was aurora's too i know i have some more somewhere in the house so i have to look for them and then these two actually just came in the mail today. All right, guys. Well, I'm so tired. I'm so out of breath. So I'm going to end this video here. That's everything that I'm going to get done today. It's already like dinner time. So I'm honestly going to throw on some PJs. I'm going to order some Domino's, give the girls a bath, and I'm going to call it a day because this pregnant mama is so tired i'm so done for the day yeah. but i'm really glad that i got that done and out of the way i've been wanting to get my closet done like as soon as possible too because i know once i hit like 30 weeks which is already in like 10 weeks i know once i hit like that third trimester i'm gonna be just so tired and it's gonna be harder to get things done so i'm trying to get as much done as i can now but i hope you guys enjoyed this organize and declutter with me and if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up 
Make sure you guys are subscribed to the Brown Family. <laughs> and make sure you hit that bell. That way you guys always get notified every single time we upload. And we'll see you guys in the next video.